When parents Jack and David Worth found out they were having a baby boy, the Richmond couple rejoiced as their new angel came into their life after a difficult journey in trying to have kids. So it was sudden and it was hard. Jack says the years after losing her first daughter as an infant were a blur. We ended up losing her when she was seven months old to SIDS. I really don't remember those few years after that until I met my husband. And after the birth of their daughter, Merida, the couple experienced heartbreak again after Jack and David lost their son. Our little princess. And then uh, a few years later, we decided that we wanted to have another one. So we got pregnant and um, ended up actually losing him when we were 27 weeks pregnant. So that was really rough with the first loss as well. Not giving up, the pair tried for one more and were blessed with baby Harrison. I mean, he is very chill, very, very oh. chill and happy oh. and Hi. crazy and fits very well with his sister. And wanting to be extra cautious. I made sure I had every doctor I could think of in the loop on everything because we didn't know why we lost the last pregnancy. But a few months after he was born. So. Dave takes her takes him to the to the doctor and she looks him over and notices that one pupil was smaller than the other and that's the only thing that she noticed that caught all of this and then from there it just kind of really snowballed into um, x-rays and CTs and lab work and all kinds of stuff to get us a diagnosis that uh, he has cancer. Baby Harry was diagnosed with stage four neuroblastoma. Always felt for the women and the families that went through it and then just to be dumped into it so quick and just with no any indication of any signs beforehand. It was very, very shocking. Jack says Harrison has a very large tumor and is currently going through chemotherapy treatment. We're hoping that he will have about eight.